TYT Sports locked out here in Culver City, California. Rich Strom with you. A signing today in Premier League football. Not a big signing, but a signing for Anfield. Liverpool have brought in Osama Esaidi. He has transferred from Dutch club Heerenveen pending a physical. Now, it appears that it might be in the works for roughly three million pounds. He is a winger. Only 24 years old is Osama Isaidi. Started his career at Omni World in 2006. 20 goals in 68 appearances since joining here in Veen in 2009, a, the top level club in the Netherlands. In his career, 137 appearances, 30 goals, 22 caps for his country of Morocco, scoring one goal. Made its international debut in February 2011. A five foot nine winger. By the way, his birthday was August 15th, so happy motherfucking birthday, Osama Saidi. Some other moves, by the way, that Liverpool might be making, or at least were rumored to making. Christian Teo, the 21-year-old winger from Barcelona. Actually, some reports came out that he might snub Liverpool to stay with Barcelona. So I'm sure that uh, a lot more news will come out from uh, Christian Teo and his camp. Other sides that are interested are Arsenal, Roma, Benfica, and Newcastle. And there are also some rumors of Nuri Sahin, the 23-year-old man from Real Madrid. So we'll see if Brendan Rodgers brings those men in. This is the third signing is Saidi since uh, Roma striker Fabio Borini and Swansea midfielder Joe Allen signed. Now some question marks. Martin Skirtle still doesn't have a contract. Daniel Agger, what's going to be up with him? Brendan Rodgers says that Daniel Agger wants to stay with Anfield. So we'll see how that goes. And also, we're a little, we're a little more than two weeks away uh, from the transfer window process being closed. So we'll see. I'm sure that Christian Teo and many others will make their decision soon on whether they want to stay with their respective club or make a move to a different club. A few comments from you guys. Uh, this is actually from SkySports.com. William wrote on SkySports.com, don't put him down until we see him play. Remember, no one knew Sammy Hypia before we got him, and he is one of the best defenders we ever had. And let's face it, we have no money to spend. Darren, here's his comment. Let's be honest, you're not going to get many big signings wanting to come to Liverpool at the moment with no Champions League football. So right, so right now, how do we get them wanting to join us by getting decent players and getting good results? Then get Champions League football, then that's when the big players will come in. And I don't think it will take too long. You can already see the improvement in the play in the warm-up games. Lastly, as we close up shop, Liverpool start the season on Saturday against West Brom at the Hawthorns. So you can let me know your thoughts on all of this. I want to hear from all the Liverpool fans. You can tweet those at me, at Rick Strom. You can also follow me on there. Our Facebook page is in the description below. Leave your comments in the comments section below. Don't be afraid to tweet, like, and share this video. It will help us out. And also, please do us a favor. Support what we're doing here. Keep coming back for some more football coverage. And subscribe to TYT Sports.